So what do we have here? The same potion we've had in the swamp. This is the Dattleberg. Something is wrong in the groves. I can feel it. I can smell it. But I cannot see it. Perhaps you can find why it grows. Did you see that? Hey. That damn bird. It stole the component we need. I should have eradicated them ages ago, if not for the feathers. The red heart nests deep within the forest. That's where they keep the stuff they steal. What the hell? So I suppose it's gonna be... Um... <laughs> pushing? Okay, well, I lost it. The same dynamic uh, that it was before, with just discovering the masks. It essentially is like a second part of the game. Because we find out islands inside of islands. These villagers were especially entwined with their trees. For it is from here that the wood for all of my subjects first came long ago, when new ones were still made. They traded with the swamp folk, of course. The treasures of the forest appeared on masks all over the realm. The mask of a wood gatherer. Highly skilled, they would go deep into the lower parts of the forests and swamps, seeking only ancient wood that the forest was finished with. Yeah, but I don't have the component for it. It's kind of like a maze. I'm coming. We're getting to the root of the problem here. This is the beating heart of the parasitic fungus. From here it spread to the swamp and was reaching its tendrils towards further lands. Finally, we can eradicate it. A bird hunter? Now we're getting somewhere. These would hunt red heart nests for feathers and sometimes eggs, until the heart of the parasite completely blocked the way. There's so many masks, but nothing to do. <laughs> To gather it, they climb trees to get the seeds. I don't have this one either. <laughs> to be fair, we still have the other islands to discover. This is where the tree tappers worked, harvesting the trees, sap from the treacle leaf tree. This is precious stuff. Drips slowly and painstakingly for years, like, like tears of blood. Okay, but I think we can build one mask from that. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, we unlocked like everything. So I just wonder with this, like, this is in the tower as well, but it doesn't seem the end, or maybe we'll have to backtrack. A joyful mask, one who lived and breathed the forest. And it looks like a bird.
So I suppose we should find the smaller parts first and then the whole thing. Damn it. Remember, you do not bring the mask to your face. You put yourself into the mask. Wow. We could as well paint the whole thing with a paintbrush. I mean... That seems to be that, but... There's like a weird line. Yeah, this seems more artistic. There are like lines on the mask. That's gonna be helpful. Ah, uh, okay. That's fun. <laughs> These houses were great lookouts to observe courtship parades from all kind of wild birds. I remember sumptuous swirls of colors everywhere. Unfortunately, there's not much to observe these Takes a bit more time to do, but it's more satisfying. Here in the canopy is where we will find high briar seeds. Thanks for the tip. Well, there was a basket to take the poison. We'll be pretty much, I guess, healing this main thing. I very much appreciate that there's this quick switch. Yeah, I mean, this is disabled, but the other ones, I need a component. A list of what we can gather. Wait, we have this. <laughs> what the hell? are inspired by the courtship plumage of the red heart birds. Yeah, it's in this area. What about the others?
I mean, I would have to discover actually their masks. This does not seem to be sharing anything. Oh, I didn't unlock here. Okay. Crystal on top. Wow, mate. Our guardian still stands sentinel over the mines. Don't let its unfriendly expression put you off. Uh, we can do this. I don't know if this whole skipping through the regions is gonna be very convenient for the playlist, like... So far it feels haphazard. I'm trying to keep it... somewhat continuous, but... A mask cannot be owned, only borrowed. Which, frankly, is very bad for business. Y'all. <laughs> is that, no? What the? I guess for some stuff we just can tape it. Oh, it covers the whole mask. Wait, where am I? You know, the other character. Did it stay in the workshop or something? Ooh, pixelated lava. <laughs> the blue shard mines. How many hours I spent down there when I first came to the Mask Realm, delving ever deeper for ever rarer gems. But be careful. Even a king treads carefully here. Decorations on these houses, all inspired by the mine workings. Mm. It seems that they are related to the way they were taking their shifts. It looks like the gate of a great treasure house, doesn't it? Oh wow, okay. I see the pattern, like, you know, on the building. No, that makes no sense. Okay, well, give me a minute. See the great lock on the gate. 
I knew the correct code from when the mine was still exploited, and now I don't anymore. But I'm sure you will work it out. I never had a good memory for those things, so I must have looked around for inspiration. Oh, <laughs> I'm looking at the buildings, but I clearly has to check the doors. What the hell? Well, the better question is if it's upside down or not, because <laughs> I can't tell from the distance, even on the Pro. So the other one. No? Am I blind or something? Unless it's sorted by height. So inverted. Open sesame. Oh, smell that. The smell of rock dust and the deep earth. And blue blood gems. Okay, far enough. 